Hello everyone. There's a rumour going round that the Dumb Prince has got himself into a little bit of bother with an ex-Archwell employee. It is rumoured that that Archwell employee, employee, ex-employee is looking towards legal, legal counsel and has made a complaint uh, about the Dumb Prince's conduct in a adult nature if you will in a um in a actual way an unwanted way that was made towards this person so we're going to have a look into how harry's response to this rumor and then we're going to have a look and see if there's any what's why this rumor is out there if there's any truth to it or there's anything to it with the cards and i just have to say this because it is quite a spicy read in this one this is for entertainment purposes only allegedly etc so let's have a look into it um sorry if my camera's wobbling stop wobbling camera i am on a different desk so um i'm on holiday at the minute so it's a little bit a little bit different in it so everything's a little bit more wobbly because the desk's more wobbly, the table's more wobbly, I should say. It's not my usual sturdy tarot desk that puts up with all kinds of thumpy nonsense. Let's have a look at Harry. So what's where's Harry in this rumour? Let's have a look. Oh, there is some stress there. He's aware of it. He has heard about this. There is a level of stress there straight away. Okay, dum-dums. And the fool is in reverse, crossing over. Oh, Harry. Oh, Harry, Harry, Harry. He's made a mistake. He's done something. Now, I'm not saying he's done something really bad. He might have been a bit overly flirty. He might have uh, made a suggestive joke, which has crossed a line. I don't know quite yet, but we'll have a look. But there is some, ooh, the Ace of Swords in reverse as well. There is a level of mind games. He is having, there is some, an element of truth. Somebody's made this and two of cups in reverse. Well, I feel like um, there's an issue here with Megzi as well. There's an issue with his relationship. There's an issue how he sees himself, the Ace of Swords in reverse above the situation. Um, legality and a big no. He, he, there's a Potentially, there's a rebuffal there. Potentially, there's some issues with regarding mind games. Potentially, there is an issue with a legal case starting up that he doesn't potentially want to start up. Um, there's a risk here, a big risk crossing over him. Let's have a look and see what's led up to this situation and this rumour. Um, doo -doo. The lovers in reverse. Okay, he's going to be saying, a little bit in reverse, he's going to say that he hasn't healed, he hasn't moved on from his multi-generational generational pain, his wound he had, his issues he has around his family, the issues he has where he stands in the world, oh, how difficult it is to be born with such a large silver spoon in his mouth, all of that stuff, all of his navel-gazing, and that has enabled him all of his life. And he's moved to America and he realizes that he is still not healed and that he is going to blame his pain and being misunderstood for what's led up to this. So straight away, there's a deflection there and people have just got the wrong end of the stick about him. It's because he's in so much so much pain let's see what's leaving coming up oh there's going to be an embarrassment for him the six of wands is in reverse now the six of wands is very much when it is upright it's very much i have achieved things i have done things i am here i am i am look at me i am so wonderful look at me i am so grand look at me i have it, i have all the military honors it's a real achievement you know bravo you're there kid when it's in reverse uh -uh it's failed 
it's a fail basically it's i went and done the thing and i haven't been success successful at the thing i feel like there is going to be deflection from the story the story is going to get somewhat repressed especially with the ace of swords and now the six of wands is in reverse i also feel like with that six of wands energy that there is an energy there where there is an embarrassment coming up for him now that could be well be grift flicks being cancelled um issues at ingriftus issues at archwell whatever it is there is an embarrassment and i feel like there's 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 something connected to this story connected to this timeline that is embarrassing for him oh the hierophant is in reverse he's really he's something else this lad now the hierophant can work to the monarchy he could potentially blame that he is a connection and proximity to the monarchy is is what is driving people to say these ridiculous stories about him and twist things out of context and do all this stuff um he may feel that somebody from the monarchy or pro monarchists are pushing this story to make him seem bad however the hierophant also links in to a taurus energy I think he's going to try and weasel his way around his, some issues regarding this rumour by invoking Queen Elizabeth. By saying, do you know I'm Queen Elizabeth's favourite grandchild? Which is incorrect, that was Peter Phillips. But the I don't even think the Queen really has favourites like that, you know what I mean? I think that's just a, that's just a little insecure rumour that he liked to propel around the place to make himself feel important and more relevant but he's gonna he's gonna try and do that he's gonna try and blame the establishment he's gonna try and blame people within the establishment there and what's surrounding him he's saying it's a lot of tosh there's a lot of noise there's a lot of performative drama around him that's your wife harry that's possibly where it's come from <laughs> to be honest this rumor he's actually scares of the justice cards He's worried about court cases. He's worried about a court case with it. I mean, for somebody, oh, we're going to get gaslit. That's nothing new. There's going to be some gaslighting coming down the way from this as well. Let's have a look. I'm going to use these cards. That was a deep sigh because I'm about to say, is there a victim? Is there a former employee? What is that energy from their perspective with this rumour? Keeping a promise. Okay. Oh, she promised that this would come out to somebody and they are watching it go down. They're actually enjoying this. Hi, <laughs> if you're watching this, hi. I bet you are. Okay. I think something's been taken out of context, investigating. I think something's, I think with Harry, I'm not defending him, but I think something's been taken out of, like majorly out of context and the person who's doing the blaming is working with somebody to get that Harry. Okay. Let's have a look and see how Megan feels about this rumor that just, She's got running away. That just jumped out there. Let's pull another two. 
ya. This plies into Megan's Megan's energy quite well. You've got the running away card, you've got game over, and you've got toxic. She wants to run away, she wants to get rid of him, she's sick to death of him, to be honest. Let me pull three cards. Is Megan involved in this setting this rumor up? Got a lot of gaslighting going on. Getting played. Lies, manipulation, control. Finding evidence, cheating, caught, cheating. Is she going to get caught cheating on Harry? Is she, is she setting up Harry? Has Harry been caught cheating on her and this is why she's doing this? Bugaboo. Ooh. There is going to be strife. You are going to see strife with this. I'm not saying Harry hasn't done anything, but I feel like Megsy has encouraged this person to find their voice and speak on it in a way. Harry's done said some like something really inappropriate or acted inappropriately. But there's an element of game played, manipulation, lies and control when it comes to Megsy. Like almost like Megsy wants to capitalize on this. And why does she, why does this person who's going to potentially making this allegation and keeping a promise? And is almost enjoying it. Like there's not like too much of a big deal, you know? Wow. They really live in this kind of like weird world of lots of webs and lots of tangles and lots of mess. I'm not saying Harry's in innocent. What I'm saying is this is potentially being made more of than it actually is. And Megsy is either encouraging it or wants the media to push it more. There's something there she wants to, it benefits her. What a mess. Anyway, that's all I've got for you from this. I'm going to shake this energy off and move on. I hope you shake this energy off and move on as well. Let me know if there's any uh, readings you'd like me to do down in the comments below. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. And I'll see you soon for some more readings and stuff. Take care, everyone. Bye.